Well, it's time. We've crunched the numbers. We've trolled the data. What your teachers and your preachers and your leaders and your oppressors didn't quite want you to put your finger on. Ignorance is the root of all evil. Got that? Oh, hey, Cindy! Ah, oh, ah, ah. Ah. Ah, sorry, uh, ah. the ride's a little bumpy, guys. Okay, that's enough. Okay? That's what happens when you follow your nose and bias it over all other senses and chase smells. Even a whiff. An emission that may not even be there but have come from elsewhere and was just passing by. <sighs> got it? Okay. Uh, somebody gutted my fucking Vogue on poetry list, so you know, <clears throat> I had to find a way to uh, catalyze myself to restart it. I'm sure, um, ah fuck, what was his name that, that did Galaxy to Hitchhiker's Guide? Oh, what the hell's that? So he's not microwaving me again, are they? We're trying to? Let's not require my glasses. Oh no, okay. Yeah, that, that's it. Because if they taught you that, you would have realized that your priority was uh, was knowledge. As well as the um, emotional side of our intelligence. Mammals, right? We're all mammals. And emotion is a big part of our thinking. Which can be a result of all forms of thinking, of course, but that would be called spirit. So, um, okay, here, I'm okay. I think I can see this. Well, the dogs munch on some grass. We'll take a quick boo up the hill. I know that's not an owl rat on a Hummer, Humvee, Humvee. Fuck off, bug. Nothing's changed and it's stopped. So I'm going to assume that they, <coughs> their lens is reflecting, uh, well, they saw me seeing them, so you know, that's the way it goes in. Oh. Okay, let's give this, let's not give up yet. This is the beauty about the mountain, see? Unless you get your mean effective horizon cut short. Your sky horizon. That way there's... You get to see more in the mountains because ground level is... can be... vertical. Or diagonal. So even though, that's your eyeballs, even though you can't see 
12 miles on the horizon, down the horizon, until the curvature goes away. You kind of make up for it because you get to see 12 miles of ground. Only some of it's, you know, as opposed to horizontal. Yeah, so, uh, once you realize ignorance is the root of all evil, that's when, you know, you figure, well, okay, maybe something like this internet can be of some service to remedying this <clears throat> human condition. Well, not really just human. Other animals. All, all, all beings. That, that rule applies. Now, if you knew enough, you wouldn't be committing evil stuff to try and remedy situations or react to them in remedy. <clears throat> you would have much better solutions that were much more prosperous for everyone. Which, you know, it, that's nothing we don't know. I don't know, you know, why it's always getting stomped and like some kind of contagious thinking to the to the back of our subconsciouses and not bearing out in our behavior as often as it should be able to. So anyhow, there you go. You got the internet, your common communication cooperative. Stick a little creative in there and you know, we've already got it up to the visual level, or uh, two-dimensional representations of visual. Even though the interface hasn't yet come. The new, uh, color. ICU chips, well, they're not new, but... Can you guys wait till seven, eight years now to work on them? Are quite capable of... changing the way we compute, up and at a, a few levels. When you can simply search visual, you know, point your camera at a picture of the, the dog and it goes just like a Google search engine, because that can be reduced to digital information, just like a, a typed word that we search on now. Dog with tail wagging like that. And then, you know, it searches instead of a, a trillion shots of bear, uh, dogs that look just like bear walking in sand. It narrows it down to a million, where his tail was wagging exactly like that. It's just a matter of processor speed. And like I say, you're going from binary, old school binary to uh, colors, I can say. <clears throat> Which is much better for storage mediums and crystal. Not fragile like magnetic. Okay, not quite ready for generating gravitational waves, we'll call it. Too powerful. Way too powerful. Come on, guys. Let's say. Ah, no, hey, fine. Okay. okay. Oh boy, the tomato shark coming along. So, it's not, it's not money, it's not devils, it's not egos, it's ignorance. Lack of information and wisdom will say the ability <clears throat> to access it and disseminate it. There, there's, there's where your ignorance is in. Poor, poor, poor resolve. And I've been cutting off uh, the hay. Well, 
actually more than just wheat straw and rye and I guess it's primarily winter rye and a bunch of other stuff because this is pretty well summer fall and you can easily get a second cut probably not till fall it's been an extremely cool spring which is actually quite warm but uh, compared to normal cool or that would probably all be dormant right now from the dry weed. tumbleweeds yes yes they have an amazing amount of car fires when the droughts come and then the tumbleweeds break off and they get trapped under your catalytic converter be surprised how many vehicles they do with theirs like that especially poorly designed ones or damaged ones where the weeds can get in right next to the catalytic converter Straw. Hey man! That's a happy bird. Come on, guys. Come, 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 come. And a quick look at the tomatoes. No bear. As you can see, they're coming along just. Yeah, we have just marvelous spring and falls here. Well, yeah, except for that uranium oxide thing in my locale. Well, actually, quite a few places. And the summers are too hot now for me, but. Because I'm missing part of my intestines. So I can't. Metabolize water like I need to if I'm active in the dry and heat. I'm not giving up yet, though. Not getting to it yet. Now that we're not having uranium in our diet anymore, eh, guys? Yeah. Lay off the uranium oxide. Well, there you go. That'll save me an edit. I haven't advertised the site for a long time. <sighs> Peace out, y'all.